In today's video, I'll be showing you the best macro that you can install and use really easily in Fish. This macro does not have any viruses, and I'll be showing you how to download it. Now, before we begin, I just wanted to say that this macro is not mine, and it was made by Asphalt Cake. So if you have any complaints, tell him, not me, since I can't really do anything to fix it. Also, if something does not work, please just ask a question in the comments below. Don't lie and say the macro doesn't work or has a virus. Anyways, let's get straight into it. To start, use the first link down in the description and you'll be sent here. You will need this in order for the macro to work, so download the V1.1 or the button on the right side. You may have to click download unverified file like I did. Anyways, bring up your downloads folder, then double click on the auto hotkey app we just downloaded. You'll now have to install it. You should get a window like this, but unlike mine, it'll give you two options to download it. Click the 64-bit option, which should be the one at the top. Then it should be downloaded. Now, using the second link in the description, head to this website and download the Fish Macro V11. You may have to turn your antivirus off for this one, but just know it does not have a virus. Of course, if you don't trust it, you don't have to download any of this. Now, if you right-click the Fish Macro in your Downloads folder and hover over Open With, you should see Open With Auto Hotkey. Now, this next step is optional, so you can skip it if you want. Head to your Roblox settings and under UI Navigation, if it doesn't say your button to activate the UI Navigation is backslash, like how mine is, then you'll need to do the following steps. Go back to your Downloads folder, then right-click the macro and under Open with, press Open with Notepad. In the Notepad, you'll see General Settings at the top. Under General Settings, at the very bottom of it, you'll see your UI Navigation button. There you can change it to whatever button you currently have it. Now we can move on to how to use the macro in-game. All you have to do is simply right-click the macro, then open with Auto Hotkey. If that doesn't work, try running it as administrator, which should fix it. And it's also what I like to do. Make sure you're already in Fish, and you should see this UI appear on the left side of your screen. Now, head to a spot with water right in front of you and make sure there's no crab cages. Then, turn off full screen in your settings. Now to start the macro, press the camera button in the top right, then press P. This will automatically start the macro, as you can see, and I'm not even touching my keyboard or mouse right now, it's doing it all by itself. I'll speed up this next part so you can really see the macro working. Of course, you can leave this on for up to 20 to 30 hours, which is when the server will reset. If you're doing this in a public server, you can check the server time by pressing something in the settings. I forgot what it was called. But that's pretty much it for today's video. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments below and I'll try my best to answer it. And if you want more fish videos like this one, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. It helps a lot and it's greatly appreciated. Anyways, see ya.